Minister of National Security Edmund Dillon has denied he attempted to defraud an elderly man. Following a press conference at Temple Court today, Minister Dillon took time to address the matter, claiming he had become the beneficiary of the property due to a long-standing friendship. Peter Christopher reports. Mr. Piper? No, I did not. That's my good friend, as I mentioned. Of 45 years, I've known Mr. Piper. I'm 62 years old right now. I've known Mr. Piper for, six, for almost more than 45 years. Minister of National Security Edmund Dillon's statements of defense as he faced questions concerning fraud allegations leveled against him. In a New York civil court, Dillon stands accused of defrauding 88-year-old Neville Piper of his money and an uptown Manhattan condo last year. But Minister Dillon said this was not the case and that he had become the beneficiary of the property through a long-standing friendship with Mr. Piper. However, he said this was challenged by a relative of Mr. Piper. He effected this gift to me through well-established attorney at laws in the United States in the presence of witnesses. Recently, a young niece of Mr. Piper approached the court to have an attorney appointed as guardian for litigation purposes, and she has sought to receive her uncle's property. She has made unfounded allegations against me and the attorneys who acted for Mr. Piper. I'm sure that these allegations will be disposed in the courts of New York, and I expect full restitutions. The minister denied media reports that the case had been in the courts for seven months, but he confirmed that the matter had been brought to the attention of Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley, and they had spoken about the situation. He said he would fight to prove his good name. And there are allegations until such proven otherwise, and the matter is still pending before the court. So there are allegations that are made by one party. There are always two sides of the story. I value my integrity at all costs, as I mentioned before. I have lived in this place for 62 years. I'm 62 years old, and I have never appeared before a court in China, the big or any other court. And I'm telling you that my integrity is very close to me. But isn't it like right? your so I'm, so integrity? I, have to, I will have to prove my integrity as the case stands right now. When asked if he would resign as a result of the allegations, he said he did not believe that was a decision to be made at this time. Peter Christopher, C News.